Hey, welcome back. Today I'm going to do a road test. Testing that vertical dipole antenna that I made. It's on the back of my garage. I have the Big Mama antenna on the roof of my car and a Cobra 29 in the car. Uh, in my shop I have this old realistic connected to that vertical dipole. And we're also going to be monitoring using my Washington which is connected to a, uh, a dipole antenna mounted in my attic horizontally. Uh, we're going to see just how much better a vertical dipole does versus the horizontal dipole. Yes, the horizontal is inside, it's in the attic, but it is about five feet higher than what that one is. So we're gonna see how it does. Um, like I said, when you see this radio, that radio is connected to the vertical dipole, and the Washington is connected to the horizontal dipole, and obviously you'll know which one is the car radio. All right, let's get to it. And we're off. Let's see how far we can go. Just going out the driveway now. <laughs> and we're off. Let's see how far we can go. Just going out the driveway now. And we're off. Let's see how far we can go. Just going around the curve just past the 45 mile an hour sign. We're out there, can we? Perfect, and you're transmitting or coming in here at right in the strawberry field. It's all the way up. Sounding fantastic. Safe, huh? Be safe out there, but you're still coming in loud and clear. Copy that. Understood.
All the way down at that bridge over the highway, and you're sounding great. You still bring the needle up be between three and five. Gotcha. Passing the convenience store you can never remember the name of. Sorry, it was busy laughing about the Piggly Weekly comment, but I got gotcha. I'm really liking this new antenna. Gotcha, you're passing the walking dog dirt road, and you're still sounding good, brushing the needle somewhere right up around three. Pretty impressive coming in that good, being near power lines. Ha ha ha! 
Wow, really nice. All right. Head on down, head on to 521 and keep going. Copy that. Copy that. You're starting to get a little fainter, but I can still hear you. I heard something about the post office, but I didn't get all of that. Try that one more time, please. So I guess it was at about nine miles that the horizontal dipole, I just couldn't hear the mobile anymore. Uh, it was it was gone after nine miles or so. But the vertical dipole, I could still hear the car radio uh, with my wife talking on the realistic at 11 and a half miles away. So we gained, what, two and a half miles just by putting the antenna vertically instead of horizontally like what the uh, Washington is connected to which I can show you a picture of that that's the antenna that's in the attic of my house where it's just a just a simple dipole uh, attached to a string that's attached to the rafters alright thanks for watching hope you enjoyed the road test it was fun for us I'll talk to you next time. Moa Junkie out.